Well, my Dwarven Rangers are done for my Lord of the Rings campaign. There they are, traipsing across the middle of... <laughs> now, don't worry, that's just um, where I've put them for now. I want to show you something I found in my box of Lord of the Rings miniatures, which are yet to be painted. I've had them for years, these miniatures, and I'm super excited that I, I get to actually use them now. I've come across... Radagast the Brown, which is cool because I want him to play a part in my upcoming solo campaign. And uh, this isn't going to be a long video, by the way, because it's just so hot. I, I wanted to turn the fan off, you know, because I don't want to hear that in the background. But yeah, I've got Radagast the Brown, there's Sam there, and Bjorn, and uh, Tom Bombadil, all of which I'm hoping will play a part. Uh, I'm not. I'm not sure whether my Sam uh, character is going to be Samwise. I, I, I'm not sure about that. But it's not going to be Samwise because I'm. It because of the time period. I'm uh, basically. I, he's just going to be possibly if I use him, a Hobbit of unknown origin at the moment, <laughs> till I create him. But yeah, so Radagast the Brown, so I can start work on him next. Because I've got I've got Gandalf and I've got Saruman, I'll do a a proper showcase when when everything is ready to go, to begin my campaign. And I am stoked to be able to do this. I'd forgotten I had a Radagast because I thought to myself a couple of weeks back I thought I need Radagast really for my, my story for my campaign what I've got in mind. And here he is. I actually have him already. So. I'm going to paint him up. <laughs> I need something else to paint whilst I'm waiting for paints to dry on my other miniatures, you see. But there we are. This is a Bench Bites. This is Radagast the Brown. And thank you for watching. Remember, all brushes lead to war. See you on the next video, guys. Bye for now. Bye-bye.